What's the deal, YouTube? This your guy, Mr. Bella Costa, and I'm back in this mother. Hey, shut your mouth. <laughs> you know, I'm gonna start off with a question. Why in the... do people go so crazy over these dunks? These... Don't get me wrong, they're nice. These are not my size. If you can tell, they're, they're pretty small for me. It's my girl shoes. Pandas, as you guys know, this is a panda from the latest panda release. I just noticed they have white stitching over the check in the mid panel swoosh. That's kind of hard. You see that? The white stitching. Probably for authentication purposes or whatever. But yeah, Panda Dunks, my girl loves them. Everybody loves them. It seems like America loves them. But you know what? They're so basic. They're so basic, okay? Black and white shoe. You can't go wrong with it. Don't get me wrong. It goes with everything. You can pretty much rock it with whatever. Uh, I like to see somebody rock them a little different other than the just white, black, white, black. How interesting would our world be if everything was in black and white? You know what I mean? We need color. You know what I'm saying? You need my color. You need people with white complexion. You need people with light brown, dark, all different shades of brown. You need yellow. You need oranges. You need reds. You need all these different colors to blend together to give us what we, what we see in people. When you go outside, you want to see green. You wanna see the bark from the trees. You wanna see the green on the leaves and plants. Different color animals, different color bugs, different color houses. Color is what sets us apart from everybody else, okay? The hues that we bring out and the clothes we wear in your eyes, everyone has different color eyes. Mine are like a brown, light brown. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, you need color. So if you are one of those people who are just hype these, hype these, hype these over these panda ducks, I may have an alternative for you, okay? If you're looking for a basic color, something easy to match, hey, look no further. You know what I'm saying? Your guy, Mr. Bella Costa, got you covered. That's why today we're gonna be reviewing the Nike Dunk Low Valerian Blue. I think it's gonna be end up being the Panda 2.0. So, you can kiss these motherfuckers goodbye. Let's get it. Into the box. Ah, the box. I'm going to box. I'm gonna do this to you. I'm gonna get crazy. I'm gonna do this to you. Break it in the 80s. I'm driving it up. I'm not back. And I'm fine for me to do. Go slash it out. Alright, that's Corey. But look, y'all. Hey, y'all. This right here, man. This right here, man. This is the answer to your panda problems, man. You understand me? All that pushing P, you know what I'm saying? Don't be pushing all that P, cause niggas end up pushing please. I mean, no, nah, that's it. Which yeah, box reads, if you can see. Hopefully that's in focus for y'all. Box reads, Nike Dunk Low Retro. And I'm a sucker for the retros, especially like this team series they've been doing. Now, when I bought these originally, Nike was marketing them as, I think they, they were an EU release for my slower folks out there in the back. EU means European, Euro, EU, European release. So I think these came out there first and they were called the Nike Dunk Low Retro, quotation mark, USA. Yeah. 
Don't know why, but that's what they were initially called. Nike has this thing. If, if I guess if the names don't stick, they go with the more catchy name. But here we have the box for the Nike Dunk Low Retro Valerian Blues. Box reads, Nike Dunk Low Retro, blah, blah, blah. Size nine and a half, personal pair. Also, I got these. This is not brand new, guys. I don't just buy, 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 hype beast, buy, buy, buy. I'm new to, I ain't new to this. I'm true to this. You feel me? I'm one of the kids that got Dunks popular. I started this shit. In LA, we were camp, we was camping out since 05, 04, 2004, 2005. Camping out for Dunks and Nikes and J's, Jordans, for the slow repeat green back. And yeah, you know what I'm saying? So we been on this. I love Dunks. I'm not gonna just fall off. I don't really like the trendy colors and all these little, you know, I like good old fashioned, nice pair of shoes. So without further ado, let's get a little drum roll. Okay. Oh, color is Valerian blue. And yeah, just Valerian blue in different languages. Dunk Low USA. See, you can see it right there. It even is on a sticker. I got these June, I got these in July. They dropped June 28th of 2022. And this was one of the most slept on colorways to me in the dunk lows, out of all the dunk lows that came out. And uh, yeah, let's get to it. See, I had to match him up for y'all, guy. I had to match him, match it one time. I could lick the bottom like fat dough, but I ain't freaky like that. <laughs> Hello? Who the fuck you go to the show with last night? <laughs> no, it's fine. Now, we got the Dunk Low Valerian Blue. Oh, man, that's a nice shoe. That's a nice shoe. Don't front. Yeah. Get the other here. Now, hold on. Just a quick comparison. You see why I'm saying that this can be an alternative for the panda? It's because it's that basic colorway, you know what I'm saying? And it, it, this will go with a lot of everything too. But this pops way more. Excuse me on my janky emotion. Now, this is a good looking shoe, y'all. You have, at the sole, we got a Valerian, this blue you see here, I hope you guys can see it clearly. This blue you see here is Valerian blue, okay? This is what Nike is calling Valerian blue. I just so happen to have a shirt by Armor Lux, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to American Rag on the bread, even though y'all racist and y'all didn't let me and my folks record in there. I love your store, love to the shop there. American Rag on La Brea, right before you get to First Street. So in between, what that, Second and First Street on La Brea, Los Angeles, California. Oh man, you can't even make that up. The shirt says La Brea, that's why I got it in red. And you see on the tongue, you got that splash of that bright red. And around the leather part of the heel tab, you have it in red as well. Nice shoe, clean shoe. Thank you, Nike, for not giving me this a white bottom that would just get messed up and jacked up. So what we have is a Valerian blue rubber sole. And we have also that classic white with the rubber, okay, at the sole. The mid sole, we got all leather uppers, but the mid is white, and then you have the mid swoosh, you know, the swoosh in the mid panel would be Valerian blue, all leather, all leather, simple. Sometimes keeping it simple is better. Sometimes all the bells and whistles and the funny colors and uh, zippers and all that shit, Sometimes it's just too much, it gets tacky. This is clean. 
See how I did that? You know what I'm saying? Cause my shoes and my socks got a core tonight. Shout out to y'all. Who said that? Luda, <laughs> Luda Chris. You know what I'm saying? You don't know about that cause you too young, but that's okay. Stay with me. Now, you you got a, uh, it's basic shoe, man. It's not too many bells and whistles on this one, y'all. And that's how I like it. You got these white strings. It has like a, like some type of silky, shiny little things in the laces. Around the lace sets, all leather, okay? And that Valerian blue. Man, it's a, I, mean, I love this shoe. I love it. I wanted to sell it. I got it, like I said, I got this in um, July. They dropped June 28th. People slept on them. Oh, the sock liner. That's what sold me too when I got the shoe in hand. Valerian blue all in the sock liner. Sometimes you wear these nice shoes and they have a light coloring sock liner and it shows all the discoloration, the fading, the creases, the lint from your socks, black or white socks what most people wear day to day. It gets all in there and it makes the shoe look janky if you gotta wear it with shorts or something like that. This right here, you won't have that problem. Nice shoe, man. I decided to do something simple, you know, uh, to match. I didn't buy this for the video. I bought this almost two years ago. Guys, buy stuff you like, hold on to it. I got clothes, I don't buy clothes on a constant. I get the things that I need, matching the weather, and then I go from there, you know what I'm saying? Keep it simple, it's always better. What you guys think about this, man? I think it's a great sneaker. I think it's a great pickup, you know what I'm saying? Ditch them, ditch the uh, damn pandas so I could get a pair, cause I seem like I can never get a pair so I could just rock the black, all black with it. You know, I, on the white tee, if some keep it playing, look on my James Dean, on my Fonz, on my black Fonzarelli from Happy Days. Who know about Happy Days? Y'all too young, y'all know about those Happy Days. Happy Days. Y'all know about that, cause y'all had cable. You know what I'm saying, nigga? We was on that VCR, you know what I'm saying? With the antennas, like trying to talk to the aliens and shit, trying to get a good connection. Happy days. Fonzarelli, I'm the black Fonzarelli, man. Y'all already know me, man. <laughs> but yeah, get in the comment box. If you like my content, don't forget, like, comment, share, subscribe. Don't be cheating me out of, out of my plays, man, out of my ism, okay? I'm trying to keep it going. I'm staying consistent for you guys. You guys seem to love these shoe videos. And I don't like to do the stock shoe videos like all these guys, man. I like to switch it up, so. Yeah, man. Valerian Dunk Low. Nike Dunk Low Retro. Valerian Blue. Nine and a half. Personal pair. Still dead stock. From the first week of July when I bought them. Okay? They call them Nike Dunk Low USA originally. But we just gonna go with Valerian. Because it sounds bossy. Valerian sounds like, you know what I'm saying? In the DeLorean. It sounds like you got a, like you a boss. You know what I'm saying? I'm just, oh shit man. I just rock the Valerians. With my Valerian blue armor luck shirt. You know what I'm talking about? But yeah man. I'm gonna put them on feet. Show y'all the fit. And I'm gonna let y'all go. You already know it's Mr. Bella Costa. Better be rocking. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> These dead stock, y'all. I ain't even put these on. I ain't even gonna undo the factory laces. Who these are? These take me back to when I first started rocking dunks. That's why I couldn't even sell them things, man. Who the old crispy than a bit? Them old crippin' in the motherfucker, man. Them old crippin' in the bed, man. Yeah, boy. Them old. Man, them old crispy, man. Yeah, dog. Put the little olive green cargos on. Nice contrast. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Ooh, crispy. I got the motherfucking Bitch, I got the motherfucking lemon pepper steppers. Walk up in the valley, shit, I'm feeling like you happy. I got the motherfucking lemon pepper steppers. 
walk up in our van. I don't know why that night you have now. Where's our goddamn motherfucker? Pepper lemon scrub. Ooh, you bitch, you got them motherfucking lemon pepper step ups. What did I say? I ain't gonna put it the right way up. You read. What about you, Zay? You already know. It's Mr. Bellicose, and I'm back in this. Mother. You already know. So what y'all wanna do, man? What y'all choosing? These Valeri joints? The Valerian? Rhymes with Aquarian? DeLorean? Valorian? Is that Velvetin? Ellington? Valerian? Ellington? Or y'all want these panda joints, God. You like them panda? Hello, panda. Hello, panda. Oh, you want the Valeri. Hello, panda. Valeri is getting scared. Like, comment, share, subscribe. You know what I'm saying? It's Mr. Bella Costa, and I'm out this mother. All right, I'm gonna shoot these motherfuckers. You understand? I'm gonna shoot, but I bet not crap. That's all I know. I just bet not crap. Oh, Come on, Six, with your funky ass. I've been waiting for you all night.